All right, I'm gonna keep it going. I'm gonna keep it going. I'm gonna bring up your next comedian. Uh, she's really, really funny. One of my really, really funny. One of my favorite people. Please put your hands together for Rachel Warma. veterinarian in the area? All right, nobody. You guys don't live here? No? Okay. Well, the reason I was asking is because these puppies are sick. <laughs> um, how are you guys doing? Good. You guys had a good Thanksgiving yesterday? Yeah? Does anyone have any like fun family traditions? None you want to tell me about? Okay. You guys do weird ones? Um... <laughs> Or maybe, that's probably why you're here instead of hanging out with them, so. Okay, that makes sense, that makes sense. Uh, when my family gets together, we all like to sit down to dinner and um, we fight, we <laughs> we just fight. Um, the only thing that gets me through the holidays is smoking weed. You guys smoke weed? Wow, all right, so no fun and no families. No, no fun, no families, got it. Okay, well, uh, you guys got cats, how was that? <laughs> No, no fun, no families, no cats. Well, we don't have about damn shit in common, folks. <laughs> well, okay, I'm gonna tell you about weed anyway. You didn't ask me, but I'm gonna tell you fucking anyway. <laughs> anyway, the only thing that gets me through the holidays is smoking weed because, like, my mom will give me something like a casserole, and like, it'll taste like cardboard, but that's what I needed in that moment anyway. So, it doesn't matter. Uh, does anyone's um, family like ask them like? Oh, when you're gonna bring someone nice home? Like, all right, I forgot you guys don't have families. You said that just a minute ago. You did say that. My bad. My bad. I forgot that part. Um, my family stopped asking when I'm gonna bring someone nice home because they know they know I'm not gonna bring someone nice. Um, I only date dudes that look like they'll ruin my credit score. <laughs> I'm attracted to men that um, are pieces of shit. So, <laughs> when, you said woo? That's the nearest girlfriend ever was. <laughs> I, I, I want everyone to remember that. But anyway, I'm gonna remind him that later too. Anyway, <laughs> one time I was seeing a guy and when I, um, one time I was dating a guy and when I say dating, I mean exchanging fluids. Um, <laughs> You're gonna do it later, don't lie. Anyway, so uh, we're, anyway, I was seeing him and um, he had a whole Dragon Ball Z tattoo. He had like all the way down his arm, there was an entire dragon and a bunch of balls and all the way down his hand was the tip of the very end of the tail of the dragon. And I'll give you about six seconds to figure out where that finger was going. I don't know if that's bestiality, I'm not really sure. It's just a dragon. Um, I'm attracted to a lot of dudes with like daddy issues. Um, I think uh, the reason I attract dudes with daddy issues is because I think I remind them of their dad a lot. Um, mostly like the beer belly. And I like to watch real sports with Brian Gumble, and I enjoy a good nap and a smoked meat. Um, anyway, so, so I think I remind dudes of their dad a lot, but I really think dudes should take advantage of that because, like, I'll go play catch with you at the park. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'll go play catch with you at the park. I'll uh, I'll tussle your hair. I'll call you a sport, <laughs> and then I'll suck your dick after. You know, but, uh, really, I think you should take advantage of that. <laughs> um. Yeah, one one time I was seeing this guy, and uh, we were seeing each other for like three or four months. He was like six foot three and uh, three hundred pounds. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Rachel, why are you fucking a giant? Well, let me tell you. Uh, you gotta try everything at least once. And uh, what I've come to the conclusion is that large man doesn't always mean large pee. Just so you know. <laughs> Just so I've done that research. The facts check out. If anyone has any questions, I can cite a source. Anyway, so um, I'm seeing this guy, 
And we've like seen each other for like three or four months. We're fucking like rabbits. Anyway, so like one day he says to me, he's like, hey, thanks for being so cool about my issue. I said, what issue? And he said, you know, the one down there. I said, uh, excuse me? What are we talking about here? That, Cause when you hear that, you get nervous a little. I, well, I got nervous a lot actually, but <laughs> so, so anyway, uh, turns out this man had one testicle, and I never noticed <laughs> the entire time. My whole hands, face, mouth, <laughs> feet a little. Anyway, I bent down in that area, and I didn't notice the entire time. He thought I was being accepting. I was just being blind. Um, I don't bring my glasses to sex, so. <laughs> I didn't see it. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry, really. Um, I've been saying a lot of out of pocket shit to men, shit that re is really inappropriate that I have no business saying because I can't follow up on it in the slightest. Um, one time I told a guy I would suck the soul out of him. Um, can't do that. And it, one time I told a guy I'd ride him off into the sunset. And, um, my knees aren't made for that. I can't do that. Um, to, to make a long story short, I threw up on the guy's balls. Um, I still saw him three months after that, so like, who's the real winner? That's the same guy, guy as the dragon tattoo, but I mean, it's a small pool. <laughs> um, you guys don't really don't have cats? Nobody has a fucking cat here? Wow. Well, I have, okay, I have two cats. And this is how I know that I can't have kids. It's because I got two cats and there's clearly a favorite. Um, there's a favorite cat and a not favorite cat and you're not supposed to do that with kids. Key part of that is supposed to. But anyway, so uh, I got two cats. And one of them, I got like a big painting in the living room and like all of his name is all the passwords to all my accounts and stuff. And I got a big tattoo of him. And uh, the other one I call Trash Gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> and she drinks out of the toilet. Um, well, the other day I was going to schedule a vet appointment and um, they were like, what's the cat's name? His name is Midnight, which is a badass motherfucking name, by the way. But anyway, so uh, his name is Midnight and they are like, what's his last name? And I was like, I've never asked him. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, I just figured it was kind of like Cher. <laughs> Madonna, you know, like just Midnight. They were like, no, it's the same as your last name. I was like, well, he didn't agree to that. He didn't, he didn't consent to that. Um, if that's the case, I'm changing my last name to Lightning. Or something. Midnight Lightning? That's freaking cool. Um, the other day I was taking my cat for a walk, the favorite one. Uh, the other one I don't allow outside. Um, I was taking him for a walk, and my neighbor saw me taking him for a walk, and she was giving me a dirty look. She's giving me a really dirty look, and I'm looking at her, and she's looking at me, and it's like, what the, what's the problem here? Um, is it because he's black? No. <laughs> no, the, I was like, Rebecca, uh, maybe if you kept your pussy on a leash, you'd know who the father of your kid is. <laughs> Stop judging me for walking my fucking cat. <laughs> um, you guys have Twitter? No. Yeah. <laughs> yes? Yeah. Yes? Who said yes? You have a Twitter? Yeah. Is, is the website burning down? Uh, it's not. I was kind of hoping it would. It is a little bit. Yeah. 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 For those of you who don't know, Twitter is burning down right now, so you should follow me while you have a chance. <laughs> <laughs> follow me while you have a chance. I recently got a community guidelines violation for uh, bullying local public officials. Um, <laughs> I'll do it again. I don't give a fuck. It's under, it's under the screen name Pat Schmier. So if you're looking to find me. Um, I, I'm not worried because if that account gets banned, I got a backup account. It's called Gloria Hole. So, so follow me. Yeah, the, <laughs> Laurent Singletary doesn't like me. If you guys know who that is. Uh, I'm in the comments section. Um, yeah, so uh, I, I recently had to make a new Instagram, actually, because my last Instagram got banned. They said for uh, promoting violence or inciting violence. Um, because turns out I posted a bunch of pictures of like how to deal with customers, and it was just stab them in the eye. <laughs> and, uh, 
Turns out they don't like that. They're not a fan. Mark Zuckerberg didn't like that. Um, <laughs> you can follow me on my new Instagram at Rachel's underscore not funny. Um, or you could cash at me. Whatever you want. <laughs> Give it up for my friend, Chris Hasenauer, my bestie. <laughs> Warm up, ladies and gentlemen. Rachel, warm up, ladies and gentlemen.